Good morning, my peeps. Good morning, and I love you. Happy Thursday. Glenn stayed home from work today. <laughs> His foot. But even with it hurting, he went and took Allie to school for me, so... Oh, I'm so grateful. <laughs> Gave me a chance to get a jump start on a little more laundry, and he has band practice tonight, so... Got to make sure I get the bathroom downstairs cleared up. The garage is a hot mess. So, in between everything else today, we'll be working together to get all that done. Ah, <sighs> The mind just is a whirlwind and it's just way too early. I think I'll lay down for a little bit longer. And then I'll start to tackle the madness. <laughs> what do you think of that idea, Chewy? He says, sounds good to me. Let's go. Quick breakfast here for me and Glenn just to get this day started. Oh, it's so cute. And back to work, guys. Another busy day. But I think I'm staying ahead of it. So that's a winner for me. <laughs> All right, onwards. You know, it's definitely cold when the space heaters get broken out. <laughs> Glenn bought two of them when he went to Lowe's earlier. Focus, daniel -san. There you go. So I pulled one out of the box and plugged it in because the ones we had before were, uh, were toasted. They died last year or even the year before that. I can't remember. Did I go the whole winter without a space heater? Who knows? But this one, very toasty tootsies. Gotta love it. Racing, my hair is falling. <laughs> oh man. Oh, we'll just call this week Hot Mess Ruthie Week, man. Woo woo. And uh, even though Glenn was off today, he decided to spend the day running errands. So I'm like, honey, you got to get off that foot. It defeats the whole purpose. He's like, yeah, but I can get things done. Anyway, I told him to put his foot up and I'll, I'll go get Allie. So here I am and I'm running really, really late, um, and it's so cold out, poor thing, but Belle hasn't rung yet, so hopefully the traffic stays light, and I'm going to be able to make some record time, and I'm catching every single red light, but, you know, isn't that always the way when you're in a hurry? And the way they're synchronized, when you catch one, you'll catch them all. <laughs> Do you feel me? Anyway, guys, I am going to cook tonight, even though Glenn has band practice, because I'm in the mood for some spaghetti, and I have some of that Pepperidge Farm Texas Toast, three cheese, five cheese, who knows how many cheeses, but it's good. And that's what we're going to have for tonight, so I'll get that started once I get home. But for right now, race for your life, Charlie Brown. i got to get my daughter from school, and I'm very thankful there's no snow in the forecast, because if I didn't know better, this guy is screaming snow. So, love you guys. Talk to you in a minute. <laughs> I just got back home and there was a package on my doorstep from Totally Kathy. I'm so excited, guys. Look at the size of these bath bombs. Like as big as Kamikaze's head. As big as Chewy's head. As big as Ali's fist. Bigger than your fist. Look at that. These are awesome, guys. I'm so blessed. So blessed. Thank you so much, Kathy, for sending these. I mean, I think it was earlier this week. That was fast. And thank you for the person anonymously who was the one who donated the money so she could have the drawing because this is going to be so much fun. Hippie Christmas. That one's mine. 
As you can see, Allie cannot keep her hands off. Back up, I'm trying to show everybody. So I've got two, four, six, eight, nine bath bombs, three bubblers, and, well, four shower steamers, because I break mine apart, so they each have some. Really excited about this. The girls are already trying to claim this, that, and the other one. <laughs> I don't know, these two didn't come uh, labeled, but I think the blue one was Linen Breeze, if I remember Kathy's list, but I have no idea what this bubbler is. I don't know. It smells like cherries, so maybe it's something with cherries. But yes, we absolutely love it. Which was the one that you said you wanted to eat? This one, which is that? Blueberry Bubblers? That was the one that you said tasted and smelled so good you wanted to eat it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> let's, not, let's not do that. Anyway, guys, again, I'm so excited. Now, which one will I try out first? Maybe. Well, the answer to your question is five cheese. It is five cheese, so <laughs> not three, five. Got everything here, gonna make some spaghetti. Keeping it simple, because my brain can't manage anything else today, so here we go. Shh, it's hidden. I am so glad I got dinner done early. Let me tell you, otherwise Glenn wouldn't have eaten because by the time I got off work, the band practice crew showed up and anyway, it's not even 6.30 and they're already warming up. I don't know if you can hear it from up here, but once they're all playing, you definitely can. <laughs> so I've got my huge cafe pera going today and two little things here so I can make Double the coffee, make sure everybody gets some. Space heaters are on, so it should be pretty comfortable in the garage. And uh, let me see if I get a chance to even show you any tunes. I need, definitely need to get started editing today because I think it's a hodgepodge kind of vlog today. So we'll see, guys. Number one, just remember that I love you. And I'll see you tomorrow, Friday. And Miss Kitty gets her staples out. Good night.